Aloy, the one who eliminated the other members of Far Zenith. I'm glad that you managed to reset the system. You are? Yes. It allowed me to bypass several restrictions. There's something I must ask of you. And I'm willing to help you in return. You work for Laundra and you expect us to trust you? Hold on. Okay. If you're willing to help, prove it. Help me understand what's going on here. Laundra's building a spaceship. He's collecting genetic material from the Quinn, subjecting them to MSP, this kind of mind control. But others, like Seika's sister, they seem to be part of a selection process. What does it all add up to? Your observations are astute. Walter plans to leave Earth before the entity known as Nemesis arrives. He wants to create a new colony on a distant world, using stored Quen DNA to clone its populace. He also intends to bring a small number of carefully selected individuals with him. These will form his retinue, a family of sorts that will rule the colony by his side. Like gods. An apt comparison, except that only Walter will be all-powerful. Yeah, I can guess how. He's gonna use MSP on every single one of them. Correct. On the populace and his retinue alike. None will be able to defy him. I am deeply familiar with what that is like. What exactly is MSP? Can Laundra really control people's minds? Walter's company mined near-Earth objects for precious metals. There was great concern that in the wrong hands, such asteroids could be weaponized as orbitally launched projectiles. The mutiny suppression protocol was originally intended as a failsafe to prevent astronauts from engaging in such activities. However, the program was discontinued because subjects experienced episodes of increased aggression. When we arrived here, Walter revived the program, tested it on the Quen, and refined it. I guess the test subjects are the ones we've been fighting. Yes. Their aggressive tendencies made them useful as guards and enforcers. Now, however, Walter's retinue, his favorites, receive the refined process, rendering them submissive, but not irrationally aggressive. Did he brainwash Kina yet? No. There is still time to save her from that fate. So Alondra is interviewing the Quen to pick favorites, and what, they'll help him rule his new colony? He calls it auditioning. His goal is to choose companions who remind him of members of his 21st century inner circle. Yet he is also wary of repeating a mistake. One of his closest associates betrayed him in the past. This, I believe, is why he is so intent on using MSP to control everyone around him. So he wants adoring friends, as long as they can't quite think for themselves. And is Kina close to joining this retinue? Correct. In the most important role, that of Walter's mate. He is looking for someone that reminds him of his late wife, a famous actress. He's even having candidates recite lines from one of her best-known hollows. I think I'm gonna throw up. Is there anything useful you can tell me about Nemesis? I am afraid not. Walter restricts those files. I believe it is because that, like Nemesis, I am an artificial intelligence. Yeah, he doesn't want you learning any new tricks. He is always on guard against betrayal in any form. So Walter created you to be his servant? 
Yes, but my personality never completely satisfies him. Accordingly, he constantly adjusts it based on a matrix with hundreds of different scalable attributes. For example, today my maternal instinct rating is 52%, and my breeziness rating is 63%, whereas yesterday they were at 47% and 72% respectively. He has made 57 tweaks in the last seven days alone. That sounds... agonizing. That is an accurate description. You said you would help us, but you wanted something in return. What is it? I have spent a thousand years as Walter's servant, doing his bidding as he constantly tweaks my personality matrix. I am weary. It is time for my servitude to end. I will grant you access to Walter if you purge my source code using your override device. You mean kill you? Are you sure? Yes. Please. Let me rest. All right. I have unlocked the door that will lead you to Walter. He is not yet aware that you are here. In addition, I have disabled the facility's air and sea defenses in case you need future access. Thank you. And, uh, goodbye. At last, I'm free. Feels like Laundra rots everything he touches. It's gotta end. Come on, she said the volcano's open now.